everybody, it's Melissa and I'm going to show you how we're going to take this thrift store frame that I got. I got this for uh, $2 and it's uh, kind of a, a longer frame, uh, but I really liked the uh, gold that it's going to bring underneath of what I'm going to paint it and I liked the pattern on the frame. So I uh, got this for two bucks. What we're going to do is take about uh, two or three coats of white paint on the frame. I'm gonna take this glass frame out and I'm gonna turn it into a chalkboard with a chalkboard spray paint. Uh, so I'll come back and show you uh, what we're gonna do after we get uh, the basics of this project done. All right, so today we are back to our thrift store uh, find. Uh, we got this frame and we painted with three coats of white spray paint. We painted with two coats of chalkboard spray paint. And then you guys voted uh, between these two and you voted on hot coffee. So we're going to do that. But first I wanna take this freshly painted um, beautiful frame that we have here and we are going to rough it up a little bit with uh, just some of uh, this 220 um, sandpaper. So we're just going to kind of um, go just a little bit. We're not going to get crazy. I really like to do the, the uh, embellishments right here. So there's some, some little um, ridges on the frame those are great to give it that aged look uh, so just go around those edges and kind of give it a, a vintage look go around some of the edges here some of those embellishments you can see it might have to use a couple um, things of, of uh, paper because that paint really sticks to it. So just go around the edges like this, play with it a little bit, get it to where you want it. I just wanted to give it just a little bit of an aged look, not a whole lot. I really like the white. And go around the middle and then we'll be done. That is quite enough. So just blow it off. Made a mess. And there we go. So you do want to make sure that you get uh, all the pieces off because we're going to chalk this now. So uh, I'm actually going to hit it with a hairdryer really quick. That didn't work at all. So basically just, I was trying to blow off some of that off of the, the board. So uh, now we're going to take our hot coffee and we are going to cut this right down the middle. I'm really addicted to these uh, frames from the thrift store because they cost me $2. And the spray paint, the chalkboard spray paint, you can get from uh, Home Depot or anywhere for like $4 for a can of spray paint. I'm going to fix the camera here. And, um, and then the white paint is $4 as well. It's like $3.96. And you can get that from Walmart. You can get that anywhere. Uh, so I love it, love it, love it. Super cheap to do. Okay, so we're just going to go ahead and uh, see where we're going to put that, center it, and then we are going to use our fuzz cloth. Do this side. This side. This is a big transfer. I actually haven't um, done a transfer that's long like this, so hopefully this goes well. 
All right, we're gonna put this right in the middle, get my hair out of there. I shed everywhere. All right, that looks nice and centered. So we're gonna put this down. Then we're gonna make sure there's no bubbles. It's pressed down really well. All right, now we're gonna take our white paste. And since this is a big transfer, I'm actually gonna put some on here. And do it like this. All right, so here we go. easy that was. Okay, now we're gonna get the excess off. Go like this. Put it back in our container so we can use it again. Love that we can use it over and over and it lasts forever. And then we are going to pull this transfer up and we're gonna do it slowly so that if we mess something up, we can actually put it back down and do it again. Looking good to me. Holy moly, that looks awesome. I am so excited. That looks really, really great. That is our uh, thrift store $2 frame. And um, that turned out really, really great. I love it.